How will you leave your mark to supersize and grow your business? It reminds you of that expression. That's going to leave a mark. I think it's from the Santa Claus movies. Obviously, I'm a grandma and a mom, and those movies are part of our holiday tradition. But that's not our topic today. Our idiom today is leave a mark. How are you going to leave a mark or a lasting impression as you grow and build and supersize your business? Because if people don't think of you, if they don't remember you, if they don't think of your business first, when they have a problem that they want solved and they know that you're the answer to their their prayers and their problems, then they will go to your competition. And that means we need to find creative ways and, and great positive ways to leave a mark, create a legacy, make sure that we are top of mind when people need our products and our services when it comes to building and growing and supersizing our business. So leaving a mark, the this is another one of those frustrating for me idioms that doesn't have a clear origin. It's a little fuzzy and it's hard to, to pinpoint where it came from but they suspect that it developed organically over time as people wanted to figure out the meaning of their life and make the world a better place, leave some kind of a positive, because it infers positive lasting impression. They wanna do something or, or affect people in a way that they are remembered. Uh, it's the whole topic of leaving a legacy. Our topic for this year's annual challenge this month is all about contribution. How are we showing up and what are we doing besides our own little life and our own self, how are we impacting the rest of the world? Now we can impact the world in small ways or in super large ways. We can just be a great example of a, a good human being and that will leave a lasting impression because the world needs more examples of how people should treat one another and how they should show up in the world. But most of us want to do something a little bigger, a little bolder and a little broader than that as we especially grow and build and supersize our businesses. So how do we make our presence known? How do we make sure our actions, what do we want our actions to be and what do we want to be known for? What do we want to be famous for with respect to our business? Because people will then remember us and choose to do business with us. Uh, so I guess I, I, I look at this one of two ways. Do I want to show up in the world and be an example or do I want to be a warning? Uh, I guarantee I have been both in my lifetime uh, for different people in different situations. But uh, how, how do we want our business to be perceived by other people? We do this through branding, marketing, advertising, uh, being involved with our communities, uh, having projects and doing things that work for us. So I'm curious today, what kind of a mark are you or you and your business leaving on others on on your community on the world as a whole etc share in the comments below because this inquiring mind would love to know uh that's it that's all i've got today go out make it an awesome day leave your mark and i will of course be with you tomorrow bye